Father, have your way right now. Perfect those things concerning us. We declare that a prayer shield, the anointing and bloodline, form our hedge of protection, which hides us from familiar spirits and all other demonic personalities, making it difficult, if not impossible, for them to effectively trace or track us in the realm of the spirit or in the physical. There shall be no perforations or penetrations. I release. We release our names into the atmosphere and declare that prayer warriors, intercessors, and prophetic watchmen are picking us up in the realm of the spirit. I speak that they will not cease or come down from their watchtowers until their assignment has been complete. I declare the spirit of the Lord is upon me, the spirit of wisdom, understandings, divine counsel, and supernatural might. Knowledge and the utmost fear of Jehovah are ours right now in Jesus' name. And as we advance, we are divinely empowered and increase in skill and understanding. I obliterate in Jesus Christ's name and annihilate satanic impressions, illusions, projections, perceptions, suggestions, suspicions, and deceptions set up as a decoy or ambush to our souls and those assigned to pray with me, for me, on behalf of me and anyone who is with me, you are with me. Those that work with me are assigned to me and interact with me daily. Father, overthrow the plans of troublemakers, scorners, scoffers, mockers, persecutors, and character assassins. Expose satanic representatives and grant unto me divine strategies and tactics to identify, resist, and overcome plots and plans established for my demise. Draw out your spear and stop them in their way. Let them be confounded and put to shame. Let them fall by their own counsels. Let them be turned back and brought to confusion. Let them be as chaff driven by the wind. Let the angel of the Lord persecute them. Let their way be through dark and slippery places, with the angel of the Lord pursuing and afflicting them. Let them be put to shame and dishonor those who seek and require of our lives. Let them be turned back and co-founded who planned our hurt. Let destruction come to them suddenly. Let them fall to their own destruction. Let destruction come upon them unaware. Let them stumble and fall into the very destruction they have contrived for me. Let them be wounded and destroyed by the very weapons they have devised for me. Let them be caught in the same net that they have set for me and all those who are with me. Let them be hung by the very noose that they have constructed for us. Let them be buried in the very fire they have lit for us. Let them be consumed by the very beast that they have prepared for us. Strike them down in the very act of their mischief. Let their mischief be returned to them doublefold. Pluck them out of their dwelling place. Root them out of the land of the living. Let evil slay them and desolation be their lot. Make them like a wheel turning in confusion. Make them as the stubble before the wind. Make them as wood burned by fire. Persecute them with your temptest. Cause fear and terror to grip their hearts. Let them be confounded and troubled forever. To halt. To all distractive, disturbing, and destructive measures. For this is the reason why the Son of God was made manifest. So that you would destroy the works of the enemy. We prevail against satanic inhibitions, prohibitions, limitations, self-limiting beliefs. And we declare that all invisible and invincible walls are destroyed by the God whom through all things are possible. We disapprove, nullify, dismantle, cancel, and forcefully oppose any satanic operations, maneuvers, manipulations, subversions, strategies, tactics, plots, plans, and ploys which are to hinder, prevent, frustrate, foil, deny, or delay God's original plans and purposes from their quick, sift, and speedy manifestation, particularly in their correct time and season. We prohibit the alteration and changing of any time or laws concerning our lives and our ministries 
in the lives of our families. We move synchronized and syncopated to the choreographed move of God. We declare that our times and seasons are in the hand of the Lord and that they shall not be altered or adjusted by anyone or anything. God gives us the divine ability to accurately discern our times and seasons in Jesus' name. We declare that this day we operate according to God's divine timetable and calendar. And we declare that God's agenda is our agenda. We are not our own because we have been bought with a price. We therefore submit ourselves to him alone. We declare that like Jesus, we come in the volume of the book. It is written of us. We declare that the eyes of our spirit function with 2020 vision for correct understanding and interpretation of divine movements. We declare that our ears are in tune with the correct frequency of the spirit and that we have clear transmission. We employ the host of heaven to war against the host of darkness. Take command over, bring to a halt, and place a moratorium on further demonic movements and satanic activities emanating from the underworld in its six regions, death, hell, Sheol, Hades, the grave, the pit, the abyss, regions of the sea, heavens, terrestrial and celestial domains, and we superimpose the prophetic word over all abortive measures, strategies, and tactics of the enemy. We overrule and overthrow ill-spoken words, ill wishes, enchantments, divinations, spells, hexes, curses, witchcraft prayers, and every idle word spoken contrary to God's original plan and purposes, and we reverse the curse associated with these utterances and declare that they shall not stand, they shall not take root, they shall not come to pass, their violent verbal dealings are returned to them doublefold, and we come against falsehoods, slander, speculation, accusation, misrepresentation, and character assassination. Father, cause the heavens to bow down with divine judgment. Cast forth lightning to scatter them. Shoot out your arrows to destroy them. Send your hand from above and rid us of them, God. We prohibit the accuser of the brethren from operating or influencing the solar mind of anyone who comes in contact with us. We reverse the effect of any stigmas and declare that divine favor, grace, honor, and well wishes now replace any and all negative feelings, perceptions, and thoughts concerning ourselves, our family, and the work and ministries in which we are called to accomplish. Holy Father who art in heaven, rebuke and dismantle satanic alliances and confederations. Arrest them by the Spirit. Let every covert and or clandestine effort and endeavor fail. Disappoint the devices that they have crafted so their hands cannot perform their enterprise. Take them in their own crafty and devious ways. Let them meet with darkness in the daytime and grope in the noonday as in the night. Overrule and overthrow, sabotage subversions and setbacks. Let every attack of retaliation completely and utterly fail. Let them come to ruin. Send divine and angelic prophetic assaults and maneuvers against diabolical intelligence. O oh God, put a prayer shield around our home and send kingmen and archangels to guard it. Release divine viruses to invade satanic databases and command that they be consumed and destroyed. Blot out all diabolical records so that the accuser of the brethren has nothing upon which he may substantiate his accusations and allegations. Let all future diabolical communications and networkings fail. Send a spirit of confusion amongst them. Let their tongues be divided so that when they communicate it will be incoherent and misunderstood. I prohibit satanic manifestations and speak that divine abortive measures and miscarriages occur in satanic wombs and incubators. Now, Father, you have given me a great work to accomplish. You have given all of us a great work to accomplish. And we war for the releasing of finances and all resources that belong to us, that have belonged to us before the foundation of the world that pertains to our callings and godliness.